Your zone electric vehicle is equipped with a Curtis 1268 motor controller. The controller is equipped with a self-diagnostics feature in form of an LED status light. If at any time your vehicle experiences a usability fault, the status light will flash an error sequence. Refer to the Specs and Warranties tab on our website to obtain the specs for your Curtis controller. Located next to your Curtis controller is the main contact or power solenoid. Linked to the main contact by this copper bar is your 425 amp main bus fuse. Next to the main bus fuse in a gray plastic case is a 20 amp ceramic power fuse. Before working on any electrical components on your vehicle, disconnect the main positive cable to avoid electrical shock. To replace a control in your vehicle, using a 13 millimeter or half inch wrench, disconnect the three large gauge cables from the bottom of the controller. Next, unplug the 24 pin and the 6 pin from the center of the controller. Then, using a 10 millimeter wrench, disconnect the red and the black field winding coils from either side. Finally, using a 10 millimeter ratchet, remove the four bolts at all four corners of your controller. At this point, you are free and clear and ready for removal of your controller. Please note, the underside of the controller is lubricated with dielectric grease and you may need to slide or pry the base of the controller from its mounting plate. To remove and replace the main contact, once again, make sure your batteries are disconnected before performing any service work on the electrical components. Using a wrench, loosen and remove both brass colored nuts from the posts extending from the solenoid. Using a long number two Phillips screwdriver, remove the two Phillips screws on the mounting plate. Next, unhook the two spade terminals from the side of your contact. You can now remove and replace your new main contact. If you were replacing the main bus fuse at the same time you were replacing the main contact, remove these two nuts and replace the fuse. To remove the ceramic fuse, pull the tab of the gray case straight upwards to expose the fuse. 